we were in the car uh, recently with my, uh, my stepdaughter who's in the Air Force and, and, and she's in Alaska now, but she was in, in Texas at the time. She came and saw me and we were driving and a song came on the radio that she never heard before and she just looked at it and then she got her phone and went like that and then I go, did, did you just buy that song? And she's like, yeah. I go, you realize how lucky you have it? Like hearing a song you've never heard, having the technology for your phone to tell you who that is. Like, she's like, yeah, that's, that's not that hard. Yes, it used to be way harder than that. <laughs> used to hear a song, like your radio gave you zero information. Back in the day, your radio, nothing came out of your center console. Back in my day, you want to know what time it was, you had to drive by a bank. <laughs> it's the only place to let you know the temperature and the time of the city you lived in. That's how you knew. And then what would happen is you would drive, you'd hear a song you like on the radio, and the whole time that song's on, all you're thinking is, DJ guy, tell me, tell me who's singing this song. Tell me who's singing this, and they never would. That would be, they'd always go on, hey, that was a great one, 715, who did Don't forget Friday, I'll be at Industry from seven to nine. Make sure you come on down to Pontiac then, and Wyandotte will be at the Hayloft on Saturday from nine to 10. And Barnstormers on Sunday, all ages. Make sure y'all check out. Hey, 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 hey. Okay. So then you'd have, like, this song stuck in your head, and then you would have to drive to the mall to find the song, because that's where we used to keep music. And I'd always make a pit stop in one of my clothing stores at the time, probably a Chess King or merry go -round. Myself some Z Cabaricis or some Jabos, right? Then you'd walk in a Harmony House, right? <laughs> then you'd have to walk up to the counter, then sing that to that guy. There was no app. You were just, it was never a good song. You're like, what's up, man? Hey, do you got that song? I believe it was number four on the Hot 9 and 9. Do you have that one? I think it won Slam It or Jam It like four days in a row. Do you, do you have that song? Do you know how it goes? Yeah, but there's people behind me. Do you want to take care of them? And then... No, just tell me the song. I don't... It's, it's, like, it's like... Nobody's gonna break my stride. Nobody's gonna hold me down. Oh no, oh no, I got this. Right? And even if they know it, they're like, I don't know it, keep singing. Hold on, let me get all the girls who work at Structure to come over and look at your... You're still putting on a concert. You know that song, Let Me Rub You Up and Down. <laughs> Lost you guys on that reference. <laughs> you know that song, Lady, you're the one. I don't even know if that's your era. <laughs> Now, every time I look at you guys, I'm trying to think of songs from your air. And then every time I look over here, I think of 20 year olds, so my brain's about to explode. <laughs> we got a mighty convoy moving through the night. There's a bear in the air, got a grand, gonna get you some. 